Kusia Champon, I'm a lecturer at the University of Cape Coast, the central region of Ghana. Today I'm talking about three things that can make work fun. Sometimes work becomes very uninteresting, it can boring and stressful. It's natural as we do the same thing over and over again at a point we feel that uh, things have become so normal. We don't have the energy anymore. We don't have the strength anymore. We are not more interested. We are no more interested in the thing that uh, we have been doing for several years. That sometimes make work no more fun, make work tedious, very difficult to do. And whenever it's getting to Monday morning, we already feel the stress that comes with that day. And so it's important that we find a way to make work fun and enjoy and pleasurable so that it doesn't come with a stress and that eventually begins to affect our health when we are always stressful going to work. It's, it affects our health. Health is very important in this in this life. And that's why today I'm talking about it. If this is your first time watching this channel, visiting our channel, you are welcome. Please feel free to subscribe. If you like our video, you can still like and share our videos if you enjoy it. If you are already subscribed, if you have already subscribed to our channel, thank you for subscribing. You can like and share this video if you enjoy it. The first point I want to look at is revisit your mission and your goal. Sometimes you lose, you forget about our mission and our goals in life and why you are working at that place. And that begins to affect us. You become, you become stressful because now you've forgotten about why you are working there. Probably when we were unemployed, we, we were so passionate for looking for a job and God gave us that job. But now, it looks like things have become normal. We feel like we are entitled to the things that we are getting. And so if you are not getting the promotions, you are not getting the salary increments, that begins to affect us. We begin to be stressful and so anxious. Anxiety steps in because we have become so critical about certain things. But you still have your job. And so you must reset your goals. If you have written down goals, go and look at them about your work, about your job. Because definitely your job is giving you something, providing food on the table, taking care of your family. And so if you allow that, some things that are not going well in the workplace to affect you and affect your health, you live a stressful life, it's going to affect you, affect your family, and in the long term, you're going to affect your health. So reverse your goals, reverse your mission. You can also, if you are into a private business, you're an entrepreneur, you can just go back and look at your mission as a as a business. Look at that. What propelled you to start that business? What gave you the impetus to start a business? It's very, very important so that you can get your fun back. Because if you are working and it's always in a sorrowful state, you are not excited, it's going to affect you. You are not going to make the profit you want. You are not going to be excited about the work whenever you are going to that location. And so that is the first point I want to look at. Revisit your mission and your goals. I believe that if you do that, it may bring back the fun that you need to work every day. Now, the second point I want to look at is to learn and grow. It's when work becomes boring. It's probably because you have been doing the same things for several years. We have not changed the way we do things. But when you begin to learn new skills, new ways of doing things, that will make work more interesting. So pause a while and begin to look at how you can do the same things you are doing a different way and make it fun. When it becomes interesting, when you're doing the same thing in a different way, it makes work fun to be around. Learning new skills, learning new methods will make your work very interesting. It's natural, but sometimes work becomes boring just because you have been doing the same thing for several years. You have been doing one way, or in the same way for several years. But if you decide to learn a new skill, go online, go to Coursera or any other MOOC site and begin to learn a new skill. Learn something that is applicable, that can be applied to your, your work. And so that will bring back some life into your work. That will make you lively and energize you to do more because you'll be learning new skills and those skills that you learned will be beneficial to your work. The third point I want to look at is to celebrate little successes. 
sometimes you work and work and work and work and work. We don't um, enjoy sometimes the successes that we've achieved. It's important we celebrate our success with our family and friends. Very, very important. You see, sometimes I see people saving all their life. They have never had the opportunity to spend some part of their saving on just the fun of this life. Acquire some of the things that will make life comfortable and uh, easy for you. So, when you've achieved some feat in your work life, just take time. Go to some hotel with your family. Go to some beach with your family. Go somewhere and have fun. Celebrate. Enjoy. Because that will give you the energy, once again, to go back to that same place and work to achieve more so that I can celebrate more. The more you achieve and the more you celebrate, that makes work fun and pleasurable. So remember, you must do these three things to keep your work alive and make work fun. Otherwise, work will become boring and very, very difficult. Whenever you are waking up to go to work, work becomes very challenging. But we don't want work to be challenging. We don't want work to be stressful because that is going to affect, affect, that's going to affect our health. And so we want work to be fun and always fun. Do these three things I mentioned. Say go back and revisit your mission and your goals. Make sure that you are always learning and growing. And the third is make sure that you celebrate the little successes that comes your way. And I believe that if you can do these three things, you will enjoy your work all the time. You maintain and keep your health because that is the only way you can enjoy your work and also be healthy this is kusia champo i'm a lecturer in the university of cape coast in the central region of ghana if you like this video please subscribe to receive notification whenever i upload a new one you can as well like or share this video if you enjoyed it god bless you